Hey, what's up guys? This is Ryan Rezaizo from XDA TV. Today we're going to be checking out a special ROM made for the OnePlus 6T by the developers M. Wilkie, Bad News, and T. Bolden. It's called the Renovate Ice ROM. This is Oxygen OS with Always On Display enabled on the OnePlus 6T using this ROM. So let's check out XDA's thread for this ROM so that we know how we could flash it and then we're going to do an overview of the ROM. So this is Renovate Ice's XDA thread. This is made by the recognized developer M. Wilkie and with the help of Bad News and T. Bolden and of course Nameless and Rav101. We won't go through the ROM details in this website because we will go through them in the video itself but what we will go through is the flashing instructions. So what you basically need to do is flash the latest full Oxygen OS zip file from twerp and then keep twerp installed so that you can again flash magisk to maintain root and, and then you can flash renovate ice's magisk module from within twerp itself this is required the first time you install renovate ice and then for later updates you can just flash renovate from magisk itself from the magisk manager app so let's go grab our phone and check out how to exactly do all these steps so this is the phone this is the oneplus 6t although amulki states that the renovate ice rom works as well on the oneplus 6. so to install the renovate ice rom for the first time let's go ahead and reboot to twerp do keep in mind though that i have my bootloader unlocked and twerp already installed So first of all what you need to do is go ahead and back up everything you have. So make a full Nandroid backup here and then swipe and then wait for the process to finish. That way if anything goes wrong you can just go back to restore and then restore your backup. Next go ahead and hit install and choose the latest Oxygen OS full zip file so that you can update to the latest Oxygen OS version that you have. So in my case this is it then add more zip and then flash the latest magisk manager in my case it's 19.1 so i'm going to flash that and then add more zip and go ahead and choose the latest renovate ice in my case i guess it's a test version here so it's this one and also don't forget to reinstall twerp because we've installed the latest oxygen os rom so we need to install the twerp installer zip as well so that we can maintain twerp on our phone after that just confirm the flash and you'll have the latest oxygen os rom the latest twerp installed the latest magisk manager and latest magisk root and some cool mods made by renovate ice once done just hit reboot and then system and there we go now we have our phone updated to all of these things so now, uh, what things have changed while flashing the Renovate Ice? Well, we're going to go ahead and go to Settings and then Display. Then go to Ambient Display. And what you can see here is the When to Show button shows up with the Left Up Display or Always On. Now this is a hidden feature in Oxygen OS. Uh, you don't see this option while on the stock ROM. You only see Left Up Display, whether to lift the display to show the ambient display or just you can just turn it off or just do the tap screen to show so now we have always on and you can enable this from a period of time from two now i have i have it enabled 24 7 because i like it to have it on 24 7 and so to test this you can just simply turn off the screen and not move the device at all and you can see that the phone stays on ambient display a lot of people are concerned about battery life now you can turn this off obviously it's not a thing that that you have to have while renovate ice is installed but uh, from my experience this doesn't affect the battery all that much maybe like 
5% all day, maybe even less as well. So this isn't a problem. Also, if you cover up the proximity sensors, the fingerprint scanner shuts off and after a while, the whole screen starts, shuts off as well. So this isn't a problem. As you can see like right now, this just happened. And of course, you can directly authenticate and log in to your phone just by tapping the fingerprint area. Now, what also comes with this ROM along with hidden tweaks is that it comes with an app. It's called Rice Tweaks or Renovate Ice Tweaks. Now, this app is essentially free, but you can donate to the developer to unlock the full capabilities of this app. What this app essentially does is it is a UI to all of the tweaks that Renovate Ice offers. You can enable all rotations so that if you rotate the phone upside down, it also rotates with you. You can globally enable immersive mode so that the status bar and the navigation bar if you have one just uh, become hidden you can enable quick setting style animation so that these things can be animated and not just turned on or off they can just flip or whatever you can change the row count and column count also enable and disable quick pull down from the right side or left side so right side pulls down to the qs styles and then left side just basically shows you the notification you can also enable smart pull down so that if you don't have any notification you can just quick pull down to the qs styles you can enable the qs vibrations and all of that good stuff what's most important here to me is that you can change the clock position from left to right so as you can see here if i just change it to the right position i have everything on my right side and the notifications only go to my left side you can also enable the left battery so you can just keep the battery to the left of the of the status bar what's also cool about this is that you can double tap the status bar to sleep or to turn the phone off which is pretty cool i use that a lot it helps with the power button longevity because we hate using physical buttons to turn the screen off and on you can also edit the navigation bar height if you use that i use the gestures so it's fine by me what's also cool about this rom is that it enables more security because it essentially allows you to lock the quick settings pull down from the lock screen so that people can't just steal your phone and just try and do that well they will fail by default, they can do that. They can just drag down the QS styles and turn off whatever they want, which is, to me, a security breach. You can also randomize the pin keypad. And what's awesome about this ROM is that you can customize the ambient display or the always on display. You can enable thin style clock, which is cool. You can enable and disable the notification icons so that they don't show up and you can manually increase and decrease the always on display brightness hbm is essentially high brightness mode so if you have that enabled the whole screen will shine up to its maximum allowed brightness which is also nice to have you can enable call recording by default because as you may or may not know oxygen os comes with call recording but it is disabled by default and you have the ability to remap the home recents back button if you have the navigation bar on and the power button to do whatever you want so this is button remapping you can also customize the ambient display or the always on display colors the status bar colors and the qs styles colors now if you want to use this rom i recommend flashing it and joining the telegram group the renovate ice one plus six or 6t support i am kind of active here as well and mwilki comes from time to time to just throw in a test version of his rom with improved features and added features to the rom which is awesome to have we have discussions about battery life here what this option does and you know general support for renovate isis users everybody here is nice they are helpful and i recommend you to join this awesome community that m wilkie and the guys built so thank you all for watching this has been ryra zaizo with an overview of renovate ice for the oneplus 6 and 6t and i'll be seeing you soon